new case of the golden idol dlc just dropped uh, <laughs> so bonus videos um yeah i don't normally do extra videos each day but when a golden idol dlc comes out i definitely do because i can't wait to play it i love these games um yeah i'm kind of concerned so okay so the new dlc is called the lemurian vampire which is curious um i'm kind of concerned that i'll need to remember the story uh particularly from the spider of Lanka. um so it might be worth having a little look at that again. Um, I guess we could just read the filled in text, just as a reminder of what happened. Like I remember the scenarios, I just can't quite remember how everything pieced together. So Bill Price lost a Pajak game to Zubiri Kera. Who was, oh yeah, names are over here. Yeah, it was you. Bill Price thought Zubiri Kera had cheated, so he tried to take Zubiri Kera's ear. Yep, understood. Um, but there's more to it than that, right? Like, um, somebody had like a note on them about like, Bill will be present so long as he wins, however he does not become crazed. Should Bill lose his temper? Bill did lose his temper. But yeah, like, Oberon's, is that Oberon? <laughs> Oberon Geller, yeah, Oberon's around. Um, was this a setup? I don't quite remember. Because you end up saving him effectively. Did it turn out to be a setup? Do you have anything on you? <laughs> Just figuring out the story. This time I'll beat you at Patch, I'll get your crew, and we shall play in the eight player tournament, the Yellow Lily. Oberon. Okay. Okay. So it's like you you got him here on purpose in order to make this happen, in order to save him? Is that what happened? Everyone wants to embarrass, embarrass himself again, round up Sir and Ruben, okay. I feel like it was intentional, um, not totally sure, but anyway, back to that. And the next one was this the one that I got really stuck on for a while. Um, Tissa Gam Gamini. Tissa Gamini killed Ari Sukera using a cricket which he found in the mouth of the statue. It was delivered by Albert Cloudsley. This resulted in the death of An Anula Gamini. Um, and this was in this thing, yeah, right? The cricket was like thrown in inside a glass bottle through that eye. It took me, I mean, I don't think I even really noticed until after I'd solved it. Um, so, yeah, so, but Albert Cloudsley brought this. So Oberon Geller's not involved in this one at all. It's just Albert Cloudsley. Yeah, so we've had one Oberon Geller case, one Albert Cloudsley case. And then obviously they end up being um, together in the first case of the main game. Um, as a result, Abaya Gamini demanded Zubiri Kera's life, but instead Yupik Kera revealed a secret in exchange. Yupik Kera, who is who? Yupik Yu. Yoshi Man. Yoshi Man revealed a secret in exchange. Ab Ab Abaya Gamini. Who are you? Are you dead? Who are you? Oh, oh no, no, sorry, that's that's a Nula. Uh, so that's the that's the brother, right? Oh, the the the, the sister. It's the sister, um, and the brother's standing there. Yeah. And you orchestrated this, right, in some way. <laughs> uh, as a result, Abaya Gamini demanded. Who's Abaya then? Is that the? Okay, that's the. The king? King isn't the right word, but you know what I mean. Um, of the Gamini, yeah, there's like... Um, where's that? There's like a map somewhere. Oh, Raja is the word I wanted. Gamini. There's a map in like one of the places here? Yeah. Gamini region. Yeah, got it. Um, Demanded Zubiri Kara's life. Zubiri was you. You were the guy in the previous thing. Yes. Zubiri Kara, yeah. 
Okay. <laughs> you were the guy in the previous thing. And what was your involvement? Your involvement was... Like, why are you getting blamed for this? Um, let's find you here. Uh, here. Cease so your threats, Lank and Lackey. I am not to blame for my father's deceptions. You are the son of... No, no, no. No, no, no. It's a good job of reminding myself. You're a carer. Yuppick carer. You're the son of Yuppick. Yes, okay. Um, is Kara one of the other regions? No. Who are the Lankans? <laughs> I guess all I guess all of these people. All these people on this island. These are threats like and lucky. I'm not to blame my father's Bill Lemurian, right? Yes. And you're a Lemu the the um, Yoshi man is a Lemurian priest. Perhaps this is the price we pay for our stagnating culture. I beg you cease to request that we meet. You know it is unwise. Vulnerable Yuppix, watchful eyes, notice everything. He is your father, you know his character. He will not tolerate such trans transgressions. I'm a miss servant and must know my place. And this is from the person who's in the in the thing, right? You are the servant of the Gamini people. Um and <clears throat> You are here just with your father who is overseeing the ritual. And you're saying, I'm not to blame for my father's deceptions. Got it. Because they they believe the, the father's responsible. Is the father responsible? Well, no. I didn't mean to leave the whole thing. Uh, uh, how do I get out of here again? <laughs> Out the door, I guess. Um, you are responsible. You received this hidden note from um, Albert Cloudsley. And that included the cricket. Yep, yeah, okay, got it, got it. Oh, they both received the note, didn't they? Um, they both received the note. Why did only one of them end up using it? I remember that being a confusing thing last time. Um, Because it only says what to do if you lose the test, right? So they both did a test, one of them lost, and the person who lost the test followed the note. Because that's what it says somewhere. Um, how did this work again? It was like infernal, fire, yelling. Oh yeah, uh, if you... Um, Fail. Oh, I just noticed. Is it split up by paragraph as well? Uh, if you fail, L O. Yeah, look. Oh, yes. Yeah, split up by paragraph. I didn't even realize like the words fit into the number of lines of the paragraph. Um, so if they fail, they do the thing, um, which ends up killing your sister. I'm not sure if you. No, no. Ended up killing. Well, yeah. Ended up killing both her and the sister. Um, I don't know if you really know that that's what you've done. Um, and what was the reason for doing all this? The reason for doing all this is... So, so you, you brought the statue, right? Albert Clouds, they brought the statue. The reason for doing all this, like, I guess you don't even care... You don't even care who succeeds or succeeds. Because um, it could have gone either way. Right? It could have gone either way. Except the daughter was being helped by somebody in the exam, but I don't think that's relevant. I think that it's just like was also going on at the same time. Um. You're, I guess you're trying to cause a problem in, for some reason. In order to... put you in a certain position. And you are giving up the location of... Case 3. Oh, did not mean to click on that. Case 3. 
You are giving up the location. <clears throat> the spider created... Okay, and this explains the whole thing. <laughs> the spider created the situation, and the spider is... Um, uh, Oberon Geller, okay. Created a situation where he saved Zubiri Kera's life, therefore Zubiri Kera revealed the secret of the rebirth ritual to the spider. And the rebirth ritual is the, the ritual they do in that second case. Got it? To help the Seven Seas Company, the Spider instigated the sabotage of the rebirth ritual at the Raja's court. But Yupik Kera... To help the Seven Seas Company... Yeah, they sabotaged it, but Yupik Kera settled it. Why did he want to do that? But Yupik Kera settled it when he revealed the location of the Golden Idol to Raja. Because the Spider had saved Zubiri Kera's life, Yupik Kera revealed the location of the Golden Idol to him at... Okay, so you revealed the Golden Idol to two people. Yeah, Oberon Geller isn't seen in this. But Oberon Geller is whoever escaped from the boat, I believe. <clears throat> However, prior to that, Yopit Kera had tipped off Putra Sun about the location of the spider. Okay. Putra Sun, who is in the previous case. Um, how, does, how do I keep ending up here? I guess because I finished the, the thing, maybe? I hold a proposition of business. Okay, so then this is when they talk about going to get the Golden Idol. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Back to the second case. So it's the Master of Spies, right? It's Putra Son, you. Yeah, Putra Son, Spy Master. <clears throat> it might turn out I don't need to know any of this to do these cases, but I, I think I... Um, I'm enjoying having the refresher. <clears throat> Putrasan had planned to ambush Oberon Geller after the meeting at T Titania Press, but Siva Udawate had warned Oberon Geller with an encoded message. So he forced... Who was Siva? Were you also in the previous thing? Um, you're not listed here, sadly had warned Oberon Geller with an encoded message, so he forced Yopit Kera to switch clothing. Yes, yes, you dressed up in the Yoshi outfit. Um, I don't know why he's a cosplayer, but he is. Um, and wear a mask. Yopit Kera was caught as he left through the hatch. Meanwhile, Oberon Geller left through the door, then killed Kirthi Bandara, who was at the, yeah, who's just guarding the door. But Yopit was left inside. And so they think they're in the boats down here somewhere, there. And they think they've got Oberon Geller, but they've actually got um, uh, Yuppik, Yoshi Man. But Yoshi Man has revealed the Golden Idol location, hence why Oberon and the other one, Albert Clasley, are now heading off to that place. Um, the thumb of whatever. That's not, that's not what the island's called, but whatever. Um, that's enough of a recap. <laughs> that was useful, though. And I'm, I guess, is this going to continue there, or are we going back further? No idea. Let's find out. Interesting. Uh, it looks like it might be a continuation, is, would be my guess, based on the ship here. It is too dangerous to approach the island in the storm, most radiant Raja. Or not. We must... We must... I am out of time. I hear and obey. Interesting. I am out of time. Are you trying to stop them from getting the golden idol, possibly? Oh, I guess you, you also want it. Yeah, because you were also told where it was. Golden idol mysteries of the Lemurian vampire. The enigmatic exploration in a harmonious island commune. That is quite a title. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> um, also, just in case anybody's joining where this is the, their first video that they're watching of mine. Um, no hints, no spoilers. Nothing like that in the chat. In the chat, in the comments. Um, but also... I have a very particular playstyle where I, I like to look at all the clues first and then fill in the thing. Sometimes that bothers people, but um, it's the way I like to play. Um, so 
So that's what you're going to get to see. I think that's the most fun way to play it, in my opinion. You get to do all the figuring out before you've, like, before the text kind of reveals a few things to you. <clears throat> okay, where to begin? And this, there's an up, and then I think there is an island over there, but it's not, um, like, a place to go to. Let's just look at you. Have you forgotten about the importance of sharing? Oh, also the color of the text implies language, doesn't it? Have you forgotten about the importance of sharing? These poor souls have barely survived their ordeal in the storm. We should welcome them to our village, feed them and tend to their wounds. Who are you? Why have you come to our peaceful island? A big wooden staff. Please do not harm us, we barely survived the storm. We are unarmed and come in peace. Right, okay, so you are um, the sun. Um, yeah. January 10th, 1741. Oh, I don't remember the timeline. It is day 55 of my imprisonment. We have been at sea for two weeks, and apparently Monkey Poor Island, Monkey Poor Island is what it was, is within reach. Today the Blade Master G played some Pajak with me and shared his stories of conquest. Why do you say of imprisonment? There's, there's something noble about this man. Okay. January 11th, the next day. It is day 56 of my imprisonment. We, are, we were on course to arrive at the island tomorrow. However, a storm is brewing, so I expect we will be delayed a day or two. Tissa, I have to remind myself, continues to promise me riches in exchange for the secrets pertaining to the Fountain of Youth. Wait, 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 wait. We're backing out of here. <laughs> so that is... This is the best one to look at all the characters, I think. That is... You, right? Zubiri Kera. Yeah, that's definitely you. You're even wearing the same clothes. Um, interesting, it's like caustics on water. Um... um Actually, no, caustic's is the wrong word. Caustic's is the, the worth of the light reflecting off water. What's the name of the pattern? Um, whatever. Um, okay, that's you. And yes, they caught um, Yoshi Man, who's his father. And let's just look at that little intro video again. I really want to understand what's going on, because I think that is, like, super key <laughs> to, to this game. <laughs> Um, we don't know who you are yet, do we? You're on the ship. We must, I am out of time. So you have like imprisoned probably the, 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 the Yoshi man and his son, right? Who are you again? Oh, you're the, you're the, the son of him. Yep. Yep. I hear and obey. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. That's why they're imprisoned. Um, you're here. Oh, I wanted to check who Tissa was. Oh, Tissa's the son? I'm going to double check just in case. Tissa... I do love how it's so quick to jump between the things. Yeah, Tissa's the son. Okay. The heir. Back out. Back in. Here we go. So what were you saying? Tissa continues to promise me riches in exchange for secrets pertaining to the Fountain of Youth. Okay. <clears throat> cool. Not a huge amount of detail from that that I think could be relevant, but maybe it will be. Um, who are you? My prince, you are alive. It is thanks to karma that we have evaded death. So you're on the ship as well and been brought to the same beach. Okay. Jayan, okay. So you are just not wearing something that you were wearing before. Jayan. I'm going to match everybody up. I gotta know, it's gonna like piece it together clearly in my mind. You? Yeah, okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, check out that mustache. Um, we have evaded death and been brought to the same beach. Because I guess they crashed, well, they crashed somewhere in the ocean, the ships ended up there, it seems. 
Cheyenne, I entrust you with guarding and ensuring the safety of the Lemurian priest's son, Zubiri Kara. Yep. Ooh. Are they on different ships? Mm -hmm. The old priest shared with me secrets of the Fountain of Youth, but I suspect he may have disclosed more valuable information to his son. Okay. No, they're not on different ships, because you were being hounded by Tissa. Yeah, okay. And Tissa was in that thing we just saw. Um, my father is dead, Jayan. I am the last of the Gamini family. Okay, you're the son, yeah. Um, now you serve only me as my royal blade master. You must address me as Raja. Okay. So as you're like dying, you're claiming power. Okay, this doesn't have anything to click on. It's just the ship. Oh, there's going to be something, isn't there? But what? Like, all I can see is like... There's wood in the... There's, there's wood in the sea. There doesn't seem to be any detail there that I could work with. Seven of th 35. Oh my gosh. How much is there upwards? Oh. <laughs> I was expecting to see like something in the sky, but no, it's like, nope, here's the entire island. <clears throat> this doesn't appear to me to be monkey po what on earth am i saying this looks fascinating um which island is this like the monkey pot island had a very specific shape we are we are going to connect everything together continue here you have a map oh maybe it is that horn of thumb that bit sticks out there's a bit that sticks out here with a little island off to the sides. These islands over here. Yeah, okay, it is. It is. This is Monkey Poor Island. So, Horn of Thumb. Oh, I see. Maybe? Horn of Thumb is like here, up here somewhere? Is it this? I feel like the shape's not quite right over here. Or have I misremembered that? I'm looking again. I'm looking again. I'm going to get this. I want the perfect mental model of everything that's going on. Yeah, here. Okay. Okay, whatever. So yeah, it's like this bit, probably. So they were somewhere up, or somewhere up here when they murdered each other. I guess they didn't murder each other. Whoever murdered... Albert Clasley murdered Oberon Geller. That's the way it was. Um... Okay, so that's back down to that scene. Guard it. That's an interesting symbol we haven't seen before, like the circle with the dots. Wait, where else is there to go? I mean, we can click on these things? What is this? Oh, it's a timeline? What do these symbols mean? Like, time is passing. So yeah, the ship still crashed. I think this is a timeline. These are clouds that are blown in, I guess. It's curious that I can't see the scene anymore. Why are you hiding that from me, game? What is going on in here? So the Murian village. What's like this structure? Oh, folks. <laughs> um... Okie dokie. Does this go over to the other one? Let's have a look at that. Yeah, okay. So there's the two scenes there. And that just goes back up. Yep, yep, yep. But there are buildings to go inside. Oh my gosh. Okay. Thank you for your kind words, but it was a short vote. Sometimes they do bicker, but only because they have the best interests of our commune at heart. It's a short vote. Okay, what are you saying to this man over here? Sometimes I think that Cooler votes against Mongo just to spite him. They really shouldn't drag you into every small decision. They should be trying to reduce your stress. Okay, but it was a short vote. They bicker, so Kula and Mom go. Yep, yeah, they bicker, but it's because they have the best interest of the commune at heart. Okay. Um, got it. Who are you? Wait. You're the same person. I th is that a mistake? 
Are you the same person? No, you are subtly different, aren't you? Your eyes are like closed a bit more? <laughs> Why are you like what? I can't tell, is that the same face or not? No, you're squinting a little bit more. Okay, I guess you're twins maybe? <laughs> you mean those shiny bits and pieces, they are scat scattered around everywhere. Matter taught us that the children can play with these trinkets as long as they are big enough so the children cannot choke on them. Okay, so shiny trinkets, these things on the floor? Okay, so you're here. Helping out in some way? Yes, I did as Va Violus Vi asked and brought the repair materials to Vito's dwelling. No, Vito's a new name, yeah. But tell me, are those really rubies and sapphires and golden coins that the children are playing with? Right, so this island's covered in like valuable things, I guess, and the children just play with them. You don't need to know how to read, silly. Just look at the pictures. They all make sense. Auntie isn't scary compared to Sterner. Sterner told my mum off yesterday and my mum cried. Community. Sentinel. From. Tower. Lemurian. Why are these the words I get from these? Spanishers. Just look at the pictures, they all make sense. Community. There's like a flag? There's like this thing here. This creature that looks kind of scary. And then there's like somebody there with a speech bubble. Banishers. Lemurian. Getting off a boat. I think there's like a story here or a timeline or something. I'm not sure why these words come from it, but... Maybe that'll make more sense as we go forwards. <laughs> that's funny, like that sprite is just like overlapping the one that was previously rolled there. <laughs> I was wondering how is this done as a looping animation, and there you go. We should stop playing. I have to practice our history tiles, or Auntie Lavu won't be happy with me. Okay, Auntie Lavu isn't as scary as Sterner. Sterner told my mum off yesterday and my mum cried, okay. <clears throat> I wish I knew how to read so I could order them by their names. Okay, so I see. For banish it. Uh, yeah, okay, so these will make a sentence if I order them a certain way, right? But I wonder if I need all, like, are those six separate from those six? Okay, there's like a few ways that could be arranged, but let's get these as well. Emerges, Dweller, Protection, Discovers, Ancestors, Brute. Okay, these are going to get arranged some way. Maybe we can just like order the, yeah, I think we order the pictures based on what we think happened. And that'll tell us how to order the words. Although that's kind of concerning. How, like, I don't remember the order I clicked them. <laughs> uh, uh oh. Yeah, is that gonna matter? I hope not. Um, be respectful, Tissa. In time you will learn our ways. Can you stop pushing this empty cart around and do some real work? Zarno will not be happy if you continue to shirk your duties and you will not get supper. Be respectful, Tissa. Um, Tissa was the son, right? Where, where are you? Who are you? Oh yeah, okay, it's you. You don't look like you. Okay. Even the senior villagers have to work for their food despite their age, but I haven't seen that old man do anything useful around here. Is he sick? That old man? That's like the oldest so far. Be respectful, Tissa. In time you will learn our ways. Can you stop pushing this empty cart around and do some real work? Sarno will not be happy if you continue to shirk your duties and you will not get supper. Okay. 
trying to take it all in. Okay, now it's just either, well, let's go in the building first, I think. Looks like a sauna of some sort. Yeah, three, two, four, 18 males, 25 females, 12 children. What? Are the children included in the males and females? This clue has been added to the thinking panel. Valley commune laws. Big decisions are voted on by the whole commune. Small decisions are decided or voted on by the council members. If the council vote is tied, whoever is available from the commune joins the vote. Okay. Council responsibilities. Guardian of males represents and cares for the males of the commune. Guardian of females represents and cares for the females of the commune. Guardian of agriculture is responsible for farm work and food allocation. Guardian of children is responsible for health and education of all young. Okay, and we do know a little bit about that because... Oh, I did not mean to go all the way up. You said... Sterner told my mum off. Auntie... I have to practice that history as Auntie Lavu, but it doesn't mean Auntie Lavu is a teacher, necessarily. I was just thinking that. Um, I agree with Lavu, and vote against... Oh, so is this... Okay, is this a vote happening? I see. It's not a sauna. <laughs> I mean, it might be a sauna. Why not vote in sauna? Okay, that's how you get back out with that arrow over there. Um, okay, we've got names. There are different colors, which is probably going to be relevant. Well, these are presumably initials of people's names. And then we've got positive vote, negative votes. I like the little, <laughs> the little balls. They're cool. Um, agree with Lavu and vote against as well. We have enough disruption from the people who washed up on the shore. We do not need more change. I have enough on my plate with all three newcomers being my responsibility. Okay, they are your responsibility. I don't know who that. Are they all male? Who are the three newcomers? There's. I know two of them, don't I? There's you, and there's you. Who was the third? Is the Raja here? Oh, no, wait, you, you. Oh yeah, you're here, okay, of course. The other son, Yoshi-san. Yoshi-san, uh, this. I wonder if these symbols will mean something. Um. But we've not seen Yoshi's son yet, right? Um, okay. I'm glad that Sutol, another name, agreed with me. No good ever comes from pointless tinkering. We should focus on the stability of our commune and leave things that work well alone. Glad that Sutol agreed with me. Uh, so here, S. L. S. L. And your name. Oh, your name might be L, I guess. S, L. Yeah, that works out. Okay. And V is the other against. Okay. Um, cool. <clears throat> Stop complaining via, via lists. I have more people to take care of than you. And I manage it just... Oh, we've got to work out who's got more people to take care of. Okay. So these are the council, I guess? Yeah. All right, if this is the result of the vote, I will stop my experiments with the yams. Okay, so you're probably the agriculture person, but I still believe I could get something tasty and new in a couple of years. Is this what they're voting on? <laughs> Whether to do some experiments with yams? <laughs> but I still believe I could get something tasty and new in a couple of generations, which would increase the variety in our food. Now can we talk about the issue of the lazy newcomer? The lazy one is... Who's being lazy? I think they're, they're both doing work, right? Yeah, they're both doing work, okay. So whoever you're, you are, you're agriculture. Oh, I love this game, it's so fun, isn't it? It's so fun. Okay, back out over here we go. Yeah, I saw that text as I was coming past before. Oh, it definitely does not say what it says there. Tomorrow, your incantation expires Vito 
swear your incantation expires, Vito. It's like graffiti in some way. Maybe. Although, what is the rest of it? What's that? There's some produce in some baskets here. Okay. Oh, is it this produce? Probably. They're like giant pods of something. Which I th you're carrying pods as well, but those are like a different colour. But you're all shipping them this way. Well, this is fascinating, isn't it? What's on that door? There's that thing. Hmm. Also, what's with this wave? Is it a skate park? They're really into skating. Like, actually, what is this? <laughs> Weird. Different colours, is that going to be relevant in some way? Okay, let's look at you. Oh, yeah, you're the other one. You're the um, Yoshi son. Yes? Or I mixed them up, hold on. No, 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 that's right, you're Yoshi son, cool. Well, is that scrolled on the wall? Yesterday that wall was clear. Okay, thanks for saying that out loud. Um, January 24th, 1741. Okay, what's the timeline here? January seven. Day 13 on the island. Oh, okay. Well, that tells me. <laughs> January 24th. Actually, it doesn't tell me everything. January 24th. Okay. Yeah. So basically, this is just before they crashed. Yeah, got it. Um, so they've only been here a short while. I was, I was curious about how long they've been here. Uh, Kruplu was very excited to tell me everything about the purple peas. Mm hmm giant pods of peas. It is fascinating that with very little tending, they provide so much nutrition to everyone in the valley, valley commune. I enjoyed chatting with him because people are somewhat secretive here. Okay. Oh, that's probably, okay, I've probably got a name for a face now. Um, that's probably the agriculture person. January 25th, 1741, it's day 14 on the island. It amazes me how harmonious and calm life is in the village. Every adult has to work no matter their lifespan, but it is not arduous. Perhaps this is how life should always be. Okay, I see. This life is, life is calm, it's fairly chill, but you have to work until you die, I guess. Uh, Good to know. Um, who are these people? They are Lemurians, but I have not heard their dialect anywhere. Locals are, oh yeah, because you are also Lemurian, right? Yes. Uh, locals are enigmatic about their history, but I overheard a child chanting, the Exodus came first, then finding of a cursed, last tragedy dispersed. Is the accursed the golden idol? This is so cool, I love it. Once you have lived here long enough, you will understand. Sorry I have to run, Kula gave me a lot of tasks today, I better not cross her. Would Kula be, wait, hold on, Kula. Kruplu, different K name. Oh, uh, okay, and Krupulu must be the, are there two Ks in the votes? Yes, okay. There are also five people there. The fifth one, I expect, is you. Kula votes against Mongo just despite him. They really shouldn't drag into every small decision. They should be trying to reduce your stress. Yeah, so you were involved in the decision as well. Zano isn't necessarily you. Zano is somebody else. Um, we'll, we'll piece it together, we'll piece it together over time, it's fine. Um, I think that's everything here, so next time... We've only got two more clues left. Okay. Oh, I like the, um, the shadows, that's cool. So this is a closer time, I guess, if we treat this as being linear, a linear timeline. Zoom in. Okay, we'll, we'll click there in a second. Um, it's concerning though, right? Hold on, where did I actually click though? Over here. Okay. 
Okay. What's that dot? I guess nothing. There's another one there. Weird. Wait, is there actually anything else to click here? I was thinking, like, oh, I'll find something else to click, but no. So you all look like you're maybe praying towards something. What horrendous thing is going to be over here? There's a skull. There's a skull. Oh, this is also a bunch of blocks, like, connected together. Curious. Okay, and you're pulling on the rope. Wait, you are somebody from the previous scene, right? With the blonde hair parted, and you're wearing that kind of thing. I feel like I saw you. I mean, you've got blonde hair, but it's not you. <laughs> Was it you? It could be. Maybe. That's probably who I was thinking of, though. Whether or not that's you. Um, okay. What's over here? What am I looking at? What just happened? What just happened? How do I see that again? What? What? You, what? <laughs> you are tied to this rope. Is something to do with that rope like killing you or what's happening? Nagana Bringad Bolbazur. Ah. <laughs> this person is not breathing. Nagana Bringad Bolbazur. What's the, there's a connection to this. That symbol is on that. Is that the, maybe that's the symbol of this place or something? Um, you're wearing like, you're wearing a bucket on your head with, with a grate cut in the front so I guess you can see him breathe. Put this around you as well, with that attached to you. Oh. Hello. Golden Idol. Oh dear, what are you doing? What's the spell you're doing? <laughs> we've got to find that out. Okay, we've got all 35 things. Um... So upside down J with a dot, circle between two lines, T on its side. Uh, here. In here. You've got it on you, right? Yep. Yeah. Upside down J with a dot, vacuum. Simply did not work after I aimed at the sealed vessel and activated the idol, both air and vessel disappeared. For further consideration, it was an obvious mistake. Did not end up working out like, oh yeah. Decrease matter and then a T on its side. What does that mean? Why am I never asked about the T on its side? Um, it's there. So this would have increased matter. No, decreased matter. Hold on, hold on. Increase. Increase matter. Something. But I thought you made the apples rot, no? Oh, maybe you made it back to her. Okay, you increased matter. Got it. Because that's what rotting is, just a decrease in matter. Um, <laughs> right, and this is how... Yeah, okay, okay. Um, what does the T mean, though? Is that able... Am I able to figure that out? Curious. So that's there. 
That's heat. Matter something. I guess all I need to know is it's decreased matter, right? Or more specifically, it is. Yeah, decreased matter. So you are killing this person, possibly? What on earth are these structures in the background? What's that? Why is there a giant domino? What's that over there? Who are you? Why are you in this tower? Why do you have a... What? So many questions. <laughs> um, so that's everything. I want to piece together a little bit more of like who's who here. Um, so we know the... Um, what am I doing? We know that... Kula and Mom, Mom go always go against each other. One of these cases, Kula. Hmm, is it their surname, Mom go? <laughs> Why did I just click out and click back on it? Um, interesting. And you, I think I have your name from the other screen. Ah, uh, let's just let's jump into the thinking panel. It'll make it a bit easier to think about. I'm not going to read this yet. I'm just going to focus on these. Um, so who's who? Okay. Well, I know some of these people just because they were in the previous one. Although, do I remember the names? You are Tissa Gamani. You are Zubiri Kara. You are Jayan. Don't remember your surname. Let's find out. Expand. What are the tiles? Blah. That's going to take up more space. Um, Jayan somebody. Yeah. Jayan G. Okay. Oh, did not mean to do that. Yep, that. Jayan G. Which we do have. Cool. Um, yeah, you're the master of blades. Yeah, got it. Okay, and then you folks who are all in the council. So we don't have the old man here. That's interesting. Um, so we've got to exclude the old man to figure out you for... So you, I think I had a name. I think I had at least a first name. Oh, I'm going to have to figure out who what's first name, what's not, based on like which names overlap. Um, you were speaking about the... Yeah, it's got to be Krup Kruplu. That could be surname, could be first name. So, so K. Um, oh, I don't need to go across here. Okay. Oh, actually, yeah, I do, to see these things. However, okay, so one of these Ks is Kruplu, who is you. And of course you would vote yes, because it's your vote. Yes. Um, and so therefore, K is your first name. Assuming that's how it works in this society, uh, in this culture. Uh, I'm gonna assume if they're written in that order on the thing, then they're gonna be in that order in here. Kruplu is somebody. Okay, then we had, I agree with Lavu and vote against as well. So you voted against, so did Lavu. L, the colors are gonna matter here, aren't they? I don't know how though. Lavu. And you voted the gate, so you're one of the names in here, not the L, you're either a V or an S. Um, did you indicate whether Against Mom Go just to spite him. Okay. So you've got to be L Mom Go, right? L Mom Go. Oh, but we have. Oh, oh no, sorry. V Mom Go. Okay. I mean, so. <laughs> That's two Vs. Okay. Um. 
is a V surname as well. We have enough to the... Okay. Subtle agreed with me. No good. Evercon's S. No good ever came from pointless tinkering. We should focus on the stability of our community and leave things that work well. So you voted negatively. Oh, I didn't see this, did I? Children in the commune. One, one year old. Three, three year old. Two, five year old. Six, older than nine years. Okay. Um, give me a second. Um, so, sounds like you voted against. And you agree with an S. There's an S on both sides, but the S over here is subtle. And you are the one ending in M. Give me a second, give me a second. So you are the white token. No, no, no. Uh, S the white token. So you are L. Is that necessarily true? I mean, because like the, the weird ways in which the names overlap. Because um, they could be saying surnames or first names. I agree with Lafu. L. You agree with L. Um, and you are VM. So VM. And you agree with L M. And you say that you're glad that S agreed with you. So that puts three people together. You, you, and somebody else. Right? Um, stop complaining. I have more people to take care of than you, and I manage it just fine. So it's, it's you that's complaining, right? Just the vote, I will stop my swords to the ads, but I still believe I could get something tasty in you in a couple of generations, which would increase the variety of our food. Now, can we talk about the issue of the lazy newcomer? Right. No, 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 hold on. I have enough on my plate with all three newcomers being my responsibility. Stop complaining. I have more people to take care of than you, and I imagine just fine. Yes. So with your additional three, that's you're responding to that person, who is the M. And are you VM? You are. So I think Virilis. <laughs> I've said that name differently every time. Um, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Which means that Lavu is one of you two, and Subtle is one of you two. You are the keeper of children, children in the commune. Um, therefore, most likely you are the keeper of females. That's not what it's called, guardian of females. Um, yes, represents the of the females of the commune. Um, so you are the guardian of males. I mean, I'm assuming the males are the guardians of males, but that's not necessarily true. Um, so keep that in mind, just in case it's not true. Um, so you have more people to take care of. Also, I know who you are, right? So yeah, and you've ended up with all three newcomers. Yeah, of course, because they're all men. Got it. Um, I guess. I'm assuming because you're holding this, you are the guardian of children. Oh, interesting. Hold on. Let's go back to the children. Sterner. Sterner told my mum off yesterday and my mum cried. So we don't know who your mum is. It might not be relevant. But Sterner. There's an S name there. And there's an Auntie Lavu who won't be happy with me. So probably... So probably Lavu is you. Lavu M. Matter? And then you are Sterner, possibly. 
Sterner V. I need to re remember where I got any of these names from. So, Lava M, Sterner V. Okay, where did some of these other... Okay, they are scattered around the very matter tortoise that the children can play with these trinkets as long as they are big enough so the children cannot choke on them. So keep... So, Guardian of Children. It seems right. So, and that was LM, right? That, that sounds right. I might want a little bit more confirmation. I did Virilis <laughs> asked... I did as Virilis asked and brought the repair materials to Vito's dwelling. Vito's dwelling. SV. So I think you're SV? Is that right? <clears throat> but tell me, blah, blah, blah. Okay. Even the senior village has to work for the. Uh, who are you? Do I know? Reduce your stress. So reduce is for, reduce and increase have been added for the golden idol scene. Be respectful Tissa, in time you'll learn. Zarno will not be happy if you continue to shirk your duties and you will not get supper. Who's Zarno? Is it you? We don't have a Z, do we? Oh, we do. We have a KZ. But yeah, the old person is one of these votes. And we know these three are agreed with each other, so the old man is over here. And we know KS is you. No, 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 we know K is you. Ooh. Okay, so which K are you? Do I know? It's hard to keep everything in your head at the same time. Um... So I'll not be happy if you continue to shirk your duties and you will not get supper. I mean, your duties appear to be to do with agriculture. So my guess would be Zarno is the agriculture person. Who I do not have the surname for yet. KZ. Which would make your name K S. Um, yeah, 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 Okay, so current best guess. Let's look at things again. Tomorrow your incantation expires, Vito. You're... So then who, who would be v Vito? You. I mean, is that my only other V name? It is. I mean, you could share a name though, I guess. Although actually, I don't think that is possible, is it? Like if you do... Is it possible? Wait, who was this with? You. Oh, it's not going to be a surname and a... Yeah. <laughs> There's no Vs in the same position. No. Okay. Okay. Um, subtle... What was I just looking at? Subtle Vito? Or K... S. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so confused. You are K, I think Z. So no, subtle could be, no, sorry, not subtle. Uh, Vito? Sorry, your incantation expires, Vito. They're using the golden idol. They're using the golden idol to do the farming. Hence why there are such large peas. What is with this structure? It's super weird. Sorry I have to run. Cooler gave me a lot of tasks today. I better not cross her. So Cooler... Gave you a lot of tasks. Her. So not the agriculture person. Probably... You, so I think you are SK as an adult, is it? No, it's SV. Holy moly, this is tricky. Um, yeah. 
I'm going to have to write some notes down. Uh, where's my notebook? Here we go. It's note taking time. So, let's find a blank page. Okay. <clears throat> let's me first just note down the initials I'm expecting to find. Um, over here, in here, over here. So, we have the four people who are KS and KZ. And then we have against who are VM, SV, LM. Now VM, we believe we know, right? Uh, VM, we believe is that because you are saying, stop complaining about the number of people you're taking care of, V, uh, and you're complaining about that. And then what was the reason for your, oh, um, Mongo and you always vote against each other. Mom Mongo, not Mongo. That's the skateboarding term. Momgo. Cooler votes against Momgo. Cooler votes against Momgo. Wait, that's interesting there. That means... No, I've messed something up. The M's are all over here. So Cool, cool cooler. What's your name? Cooler is over here, and all the K's are over here. So there's a cooler over here in the fours. Votes against Momgo. Um. So there's an, one of the M's over here. Why would you switch between? Oh wait, hold on. No, I was going to say already, like, it would have been really sneaky, but I don't think it could be the case. Is that are any of these, like, upside down? <laughs> I don't think they've done that, though, because none of them work upside down. Like, SV could be N, maybe, but not really. Yeah, okay, I don't think they've done that trick. That would have been really sneaky, though. Um, so, Mom, Mom Go is over here. Okay, in the against. And then what else do we know? What we know is Lavu. We know that these three people voted against. I mean, we do, do we know that? Hold on. Okay. Agree with Lavu and vote against as well. We have enough to trust from the people. So you voted against for sure. Which means you're over here and you are complaining about this and your name is fireless and there is only one no there's two v's over here oh okay so there's an against fireless <clears throat> so one of those two v's is is that okay I am not feeling confident about your name anymore. I'm going to actually drag it out and we're going to do it from scratch. I was pretty sure about your name actually, but whatever. Okay. I agree with Lavu. So Lavu is also over here. So the L is Lavu. I know that for sure. I remember the colors as well. The colors might be relevant. Um. You sound like you don't want to tinker. We should focus on stability of our commune. Are you messing around with the golden idol? Leave things well alone. Okay, so that means the subtle is over here in against. Yes. Okay. I 
Okay. Cooler is over on the other side. So the only S, so there's only one S in the against. So that is Sotul. Okay. So Lavu and Sotul are both in against, confirmed. And whatever your name is there as well. Okay, okay, hold on. How did I end up getting to your name? Yours is the name I actually put in fully. Well, okay, so that means your name is VM. Your name is VM. I'm going to number these as well then. So VM is person one for sure. Okay. I'll call the old man outside five. You, I got your name from out here. We had you. Um, Kroplu was very excited to tell me everything about the purple bees. Yeah. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. So that's you, for sure. You are a K in the four, and there are two of them. So we have Kula and Kroplu. Oh, Kroplu, is that... Is that what's said? Uh, what is it? Where are you? Kriplu, yeah. But I don't know which way round, right? How did I know Kula was in? Oh, because the K's are over here. Yeah, okay. Kula and Kriplu are over here. Got it. One of them has an S surname, one of them has a Z surname, one of them's U. And the other one is potentially the old man, but I'm not certain. Now, what do we know about other people's names? Hold on. I have to run. Kula gave me a lot of tests. We have another K name there. So there's a K in the fours. Well, it's not another one. It's Kula. So we know it's a four. And it's a her. Okay, so I was definitely getting on the wrong track. So one of these voted four. Could be you. I think it's you. It has to be you. Maybe Suttles the older man. Okay, hold on. Stop playing. More people to take care of. You seem against. You are against. And we know it was a woman that voted for, so it's you. So, Kula, whoever you are, whatever your surname is, either S or Z, Oh. It has to be you. So three, okay, can I work out? So I think I can work out the S or Z because Auntie isn't scary compared to Sterner. Sterner told my mum off yesterday and my mum cried. Oh. No, I don't necessarily know that. So you talk about the Z, Zano. Zano will not be happy if you continue to do and you will not get supper. Sterner. Sterner told my mum off yesterday and my mum cried. Oh, oh, okay. Told my mum off. Probably the guardian of females. Probably only the guardian of females has that. Uh, like, would be telling off other women, maybe? I don't know. Professor um, cares for the females of the commune. So, S. So we think KS, Kula Sterner. That's my current guess, Kula Sterner. Which means you are KZ. Hold on, so Kula Sterner. That means you are KZ. Um, what was the K? The K was Kruplu. Kruplu, where is that on here? Sorry, I'm making notes at the same time. Uh, hence why like my cursor stops moving sometimes. Kruplu, 
Uh, Zed. I mean, not Zuburi. <laughs> Zana. Who said Zana? So, yes, and that matches up with this. Zana will not be happy you continue to shoot your duties, and it's clearly an agriculture thing. You're Zana. Got it. That adds up. <clears throat> that leaves us with. So hold on, we've got Kripozano. This is this is with three others. Okay, we've got VM, SV who is subtle, and LM who is. Uh, LM is not you, <laughs> so you are either subtle or you are VM. Oh wait, I already found out one was VM somehow. <laughs> How did I work that out? One was VM. Oh, because you say V, yeah. Oh, but there's another V. Stop playing Feralis. I have more people to take care of than you. I manage it just fine. Remind what you say? Mongo just to spite him. And it's not you. So it's Mongo is you. VM and you are the one that says Lavu. So you are VM Mongo. Cool. And your V name is uh, Virilis. Because you say that, yes. Okay. This feels like it's coming together. And then you. You are glad that Subtle agreed with me, which is not this person. So it's the old man outside. Subtle is the old man. So five. Oh, I didn't put numbers next to the others. Kula was you, so three. KZ was you, so four. So then. Uh, Lavu is two, who is you. Suttle's surname, I'm not sure. L Lavu's surname is almost certainly whatever you say. Ah, oh, you don't say surname. Uh, well, there's another M somewhere. Wait, I've put Momgo in already, haven't I? No? Oh, I haven't put it in. Okay. So, Virilis. Mongo. Um, so I guess we're left with another M name somewhere. Matter. Okay, where did Matter come up? I think your name is Lavu Matter. When did Matter come up? And you are, okay, Vito. The old man's Vito. Okay. Uh, Virilis asked. Who is the, yep, okay, this is all adding up because that's the guardian of males. So you're being ordered around to do something that's not agriculture related. Um, I love like getting a full understanding. Matter, matter taught us, uh, yes, about the children. Okay, Lavu, matter. I am totally certain I've got this right. I hope I don't end up eating those words. Um, Lavu. Matter. Ta da! <laughs> I love this game. It's so good. Guardian of Males. Uh, uh, I just said it, but. Fearless. Yes, yes, and you say it in there. Yep, of course. Yep, because the newcomers are all your people. You. You. Guardian of Females. Not you. You. Kula Sterner. Agriculture is you. <laughs> oh, I see. Yeah, join the tiebreaker vote. That's why the old man was involved. Garden of Children um, is you. Tiebreaker vote is subtle. Yeah, it's SV. Yeah, SV. Vito. Oh yeah. Oh my, I haven't even looked at the tiles yet. 
Oh, should we look at what this interface looks like? Okay. Oh, okay. It tells me the words here. Order them chronologically. How does that work? Oh, interesting. Interesting that it starts off incorrectly filled. So I guess I just have to sort them and eventually they'll tell me I'm correct. Um, can I like drag them out? No, but I can drag them from here to here. No, I guess I just drag them around. What's the order here? Left to right? I guess so. <laughs> I guess so. Um, so I, sp I guess I'm supposed to be working this out from what makes sense as a sentence and what makes sense from the pictures. Oh, right. Because you say something about, I wish I knew how to read so I could order them by their names. Right, they'll, they'll form a sentence. Okay, what do I think's going on here? Um, oh look, that's that tower. Oh yeah, golden idol thing's going on. Like death or something? Tower. Wait, just to check. Yeah, this swaps, this moving the words around is that. Um, okay, what makes most sense? Oh look, so this is putting the, the helmet on. This is interesting. This is really interesting. Ancestors in a cave. And then there's like an emerging one, right? Or dweller emerges. The, the words don't match up. The words are separate. They're, they're, they're gonna, both going to make an order, but the words don't match up with the pictures. That's the slightly confusing. So there's a bunch of people in a boat here, a bunch of people in a boat here. There's a castle being attacked or a fort or something. And there's are these people getting on the boat or off the boats? I think they're arriving and then getting off. Um, ooh. Are these the Lemurian people? Okay, they're picking fruits. Um, golden idols going around killing people. At some point there's a tower. Okay, let's put the towers next to each other. I don't like that it says it incorrectly. <laughs> um, is that your legs? We're going into the tower. I, well, I think it's going to be emerges from tower, right? Towers there, you come out, you kill somebody, then you go around killing all the other people. Okay. This is probably going to be later on in the sequence. Protection. Okay. What does Sentinel mean in this instance? Did it come up in a previous case, Sentinel? Like, I know what sentinel means, but I mean, it has kind of a variety of meanings. Um, Dweller banishes the Murian community. Okay, so look at that. So you, like, the death doesn't work because of the helmet or something? Discovers community? Discovers... Protection, brute, dweller. I need to not look at the words. Well, I sort of... Because emerges from tower makes a lot of sense. What emerges from tower? Dweller emerges from tower? Oh yeah, maybe. Um, discovers what? Ancestors, brute, community, Lemurian, Lemur discovers Lemurian community, discovers Sentinel. Where's that going to show up in this? Brute. Well, it could be brute emerges from tower. Hmm. No. This seems like the 
the pre-story. So they get they're gonna get banished. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Is it like okay? Bring these down. Is it like brutes? Lemurian? Oh, Lemurian? Lemurian ancestors. Yep, 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 yep. Brute banishes. Ah, don't tell me. <laughs> uh, Lemurian ancestors. Wait, I got everything else right? No! <laughs> I guess I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite funny. Uh, Brute banishes Lemurian ancestors. I was going to get there eventually. Um, Dweller emerges from tower. <laughs> okay, so Sentinel discovers community protection. But doesn't somebody wearing the bucket get killed in the next thing? What on earth? Okay, Brute banishes Lemurian ancestors. So these are ancestors. They've gone to another island. They go into a cave. Dweller emerges from tower. So whoever's in the tower emerges and starts killing people. Sentinel discovers community protection. Why is that there under that flower? If you wear it... Weird. I guess the, the flower does represent the community, I think. The Lemurian community or something. Are you finding that here? Like, was that already here? Curious. Let's have a look at that final scene again. Nagana Brin Gad Bol Buzzer. Have we seen that before? I'm not sure. This is not breathing. Why are you attached by rope? So, you, so your body can be dragged away if you die? Presumably this is the community... This represents something about this protection. And you're in there. Is this going to be like... What's the timeline here? Because like... Albert Cloudsley and Oberon Geller were also on their way here, and I think they found the Golden Idol, right? In... somewhere. Okay, let's look at the story part of things, I think. Somebody somebody went to the something and spoke the something. Because according to the local tradition, whether the something endangers the something, the something goes and something the something to the something until the next time. Interesting. Okay, so it's an incantation. Okay, so this connects to... Tomorrow your incantation expires, Vito. Vito is... The older man. Interesting. Tomorrow your incantation expires, Vito. It's in red text. Green. This is green, wasn't it? Yeah. There was red text at some point from somebody. I know that for sure. Who had red text? Somebody did. Somebody definitely did. No. Blue. Maybe nobody did. Did nobody have red text? Okay, what about in this case? Hmm, it's, it's not colored text here. Hmm, I don't know about that. Okay. Um, anyway, back to the back to the case we're doing. Um, 
Anyway, okay. So, uh, your incantation expires. Um, went to the tower? Is tower a word we've got? Wait, how do I now... The words are gone. Oh, I can drag them from here. Okay. Uh, tower. I spoke the incantation. <clears throat> Who is it in the thing? That's interesting. Okay, we're going to figure it out. Go to the local tradition. Whenever the um, dweller endangers the community? The... The dirt goes and duh, the duh, to the duh until the next time. The sentinel... goes and banishes the dweller to the tower until the next time. Maybe, something like that. Um, after the incantation was spoken, the dweller was activated to... Okay, the golden idol was activated to reduce lifespan and whoever it is died. Who is it? Um, who is it? Is it Vita? Oh, it could be increased lifespan. Not why did I say reduced lifespan. Wait, no, increase would increase lifespan would mean you would live longer. Reduced lifespan would mean you would die. How do I know who you are? Pink text. I mean, maybe the old man is the... Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. There's all the stuff to do with, like, ages of people. So you are old. Thank you for your kind words, but it's a very short vote. Sometimes they do bicker. The rage shouldn't drag you into every small decision. They should be trying to reduce your stress. Is that because you're the sentinel? Can you stop pushing this empty cart around to some real work? Even the senior villagers have to work for their food despite their age, but I haven't seen that old man do anything useful around here. Is he sick? No, because the thing he does only happens every now and then. That's his role. That is his role. Tomorrow your incantation expires, Vito. Interesting. So I'm not exactly sure why it's expiring, but that is who it is. I'm pretty sure. Um... I think I'm pretty sure. Am I wrong about anything? I'm right about everything. Woo! <laughs> Subtle Vito was a designated sentinel for the Monkey Paw Island community. When the time came, in accordance with local tradition, he took up his armor and set forth to the tower. There he met his demise when the golden idol was used on him to reduce his lifespan. So I guess the... I guess the, the current questions I have which might get answered in the following uh, thingy Um are... Um, what are they? So in that story... Are you, is, is the Dweller at this point using the Golden Idol? I would guess so? So that means the Golden Idol is just out and about when Oberon and, and uh, Albert Cloudsley show up. But don't they... Where specifically do they find it? Oh, that's not the one. Oh, that was a cool chapter. I guess they don't actually say, do they? No, interesting. They could have killed them and stolen it, for all I know. Okay, 
yeah, I'm not quite piecing together exactly where the golden idol is at which points in time and who it is inside the tower. I mean, let's look at you inside the tower again. Maybe that's the big mystery. Oh, in fact, the Lemurian vampire and you're in the picture. Chapter two is available to us. I am excited. There's a little story thing to watch actually. So we'll look at that in a second. Um, yeah, let's look at you. I mean, you're just a silhouette. I can't tell anything about you. Okay, uh, let's look at the little story thing. Ah, uh, the numbering system. Lemurian numbering system. Sothel lived like a sentinel and died like a true sentinel. <laughs> okay. And now I must ask who is ready to take his place? This is my chance. I must. <laughs> As the only royal present, it is clear that I should take the title of Sentinel. Wow. Okay. Here we go. Uh, next time we have the Lemurian Vampire Strikes. I was going to say Strikes Back. It's just Strikes. Um, fascinating. Okay, I love it. We're back in it, folks. We are back in it. See you next time for case oh look they're using the lemurian numerals for the chapters i love it fantastic okay <laughs> see you next time folks goodbye